in Palm Springs. This is a festival um, that we are partnered with. Uh, I'm representing DocuFest Film Festival. And DocuFest is a film festival that happens annually in the city of Prizren in Kosovo. This is a festival that started in 2002. It was uh, a moment uh, just after the war in Kosovo where there was no cultural activity in the country and there was no cinema in the city, but the city itself had this love for cinema and memory of going to the cinema because of an iconic uh, cinema uh, that uh, that was functional uh, that that is called Kino So in 2002 a group of friends uh, from different backgrounds came together and initiated a documentary film festival. It was very small in the beginning with the screening of 20 films which were mostly from the Balkan region but it slowly grew to be what it is now, and now it is an international documentary festival, very important for the region of uh, the Balkans, but also in, in, in Europe. Uh, we will be marking our 18th edition um, this summer. Uh, the, the festival is scheduled uh, from 2nd till the 10th of, um, of uh, August uh, this year. And normally, in terms of the programming, uh, we normally we screen more than 200 uh, both documentaries and short films. Our uh, competition categories are the human rights, uh, the, the green competition, the international documentaries, the national films and, and, uh, and the short films. But we also curate um, a lot of uh, uh, retrospectives of masses of cinema or we curate uh, programs uh, that are focusing on, on different uh, topics. We also, what we do every year, we dedicate the whole festival, so the whole campaign, to a particular um, uh, theme. And we have had um, past themes that were focusing on, um, on themes that we think are important to bring forward. So themes like migration, or themes uh, like corruption, or themes like uh, change or, or, or the future. Me about this festival. Um, the festival is, this is also festival known uh, to for its it's side activities. We, we have uh, a it's music festival, festival that is called Dokunas that is happening at the same Most time and it's stressed in three uh, stages right and so it covers uh, a variety of music from experimental music to, to techno to, to folk music. Uh, and, and then we have a children festival where we screen uh, films for children. Then we have a, a photography program uh, focusing on exhibition and, and, and master classes, also uh, a, a program of debates and program of artist talks, uh, of, of, of different workshops that are um, uh, fo focusing on different aspects of, of filmmaking. Also, I mean, what the, what the festival is known for is to it's known to have created this very strong bond with the city of Prizren. Now, city, the city of Prizren is the second biggest city in Kosovo. It's the, the most preserved one. It's, it's, it's the most beautiful one and the kind of, like, as I said, the cultural center. And we, the festival is known to, have, um, to, to kind of include the, the city's landmarks in its activities by uh, building these very beautiful uh, pop-up cinemas. Uh, that are now uh, uh, kind of deemed legendary. Like uh, the, the one that we really love is the cinema on top of the river, where you can sit and you can watch films, and the river is flowing underneath. Or a very beautiful cinema in the castle of, of the city. Uh, but also, I mean, it's a, uh, it's uh, what the festival is known about is that it's very easy. It's, it's cheap. It's like a two euros a ticket. So it's, it's and it's also a very relaxed atmosphere of. Uh, of all filmmakers uh, and young professionals uh, meeting together. That is something that is important to us, to, to kind of create a relaxed setting where people can meet and where people can, can discuss and where people can mm. collaborate. Uh, and uh, also what is important for us is, because the political context of Kosovo, it's still a, a, an, an isolated country. We still need a visa to travel everywhere. Festivals like DocuFest are the way that the country is uh, stays connected to, to the world. So what is also important for us is to curate the local talent, uh, be that in film or be that in music. And also um, our work throughout the year is uh, is very much focused on education or on using documentaries uh, as, as an educational tool. So we do that by... Uh, 
by a film school. We have a film school in Prisland. We have the seventh generation so far of uh, young filmmakers that are producing their documentaries right now. Uh, we have a traveling cinema, a solo cinema where we can go stream films in rural areas uh, in the country where there's no cultural activity. So the, the festival, I mean, it's, it's known to, to be a lot, of, uh, a lot of fun, but also very radical uh, programming. Um, a lot of people that, that come there, uh, we have 60,000 visitors yearly. There's a lot of hotels, there's a camp, a beautiful camp by the river. But also what we do is we, we have uh, lots of our guests staying with, uh, with the people of Kizra. Uh, which also makes their experience special uh, because uh, people in Kosovo are known to be uh, very hospitable. Uh, so, this, and, and also, the whole co the country is, is next to the sea in Albania, so a lot of people like to to then continue their uh, their traveling and explore the area. It is the whole Balkan region. It is a beautiful area, and there's lots to see there. I think it, 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 it is much more than a uh, than a festival because it is one of the one of the positive um, examples of a, of a country uh, rebuilding itself after uh, the war. Because everything, I mean, when it started, everything had to start from scratch so no cinema um, no money so uh, uh, no uh, no knowledge how to um, how to like how to screen all, all these films but everything was um, uh, the, 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 the spirit of solidarity was was there and I think it is still there with the team uh, of the festival and this is something that our guests that come there uh, are touched by that's Thing. Well, I loved it. It was, uh, it was, we have been partners with Amdocs because we are part of the same network for many years. And it was a pleasure to, to finally be here and, and see the festival, the great programming and the great work that they do. I think that especially for smaller uh, cities, uh, festivals like, like these are very, uh, very important. Uh, because uh, it's the, the themes that they bring forward and the discussions that happen. We, I mean, I really like this metaphor of a, a film starting when it ends, when, it really, when, when people start uh, talking about it. Um, so, and, and I, I also find it very beautiful, the whole, the whole California and Palm Springs. Thank, uh, you th thank you for the interview and thank you for watching from festivals.com. Thank you. <laughs>